Hello guys, so I have a quick update to share with you. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on your location at this time of the day. Let me also wish you guys a happy new month. Today is the first day in the month of November 2022. A day we have never seen before and a day we will never see again. Happy new month to you all. All right, guys, so um, there is more trouble for APC and Tinibu over um these certificate issues yes uh this has been some issues people has been deliberating okay so we remember that um action alliance um party um in the suit seeking disqualification of uh, tenable from the 2023 election on alleged certificate forgery so the party asks um, a federal high court in Abuja to restrain INEC from including Tinubu's name in the ballot of the 2023 presidential election. So actually, a move to stop that suit has been dismissed by the court, yes, with the judge ordering the plaintiff to open its case of certificate forgery allegation against uh, Tinubu. Man, this is going to be um a problem for the apc like seriously uh when it has to do with these certificate issues and forgery things have changed now i remember when the body judge uh said that tinibu do not have a certificate yes but the judge um is not a kid that man is not a kid it's um a matured man is an old man you understand so he, he wouldn't just come out on the media to say what he may not know or what he do not understand yes i mean let us tell ourselves the truth it's a suit okay so i really do not know if it is true or not i think according to um Tinibu from claims that um his certificate got uh, missing uh maybe during when he was um on exile before coming back some of his um certificate um, were missing i think something like that that is um a kind of excuse now but a judge looking at it critically okay if you want to go deeply there should be somebody according to body judge nothing the primary school uh tenable claim he attended is not in existence Yes, according to body judge. And also, even if uh, the primary school is not still in existence, um, people believe that you should have at least one person, uh, you know, to beat his church, uh, church and tell you, oh, Tinibu was my cosmet. I am happy Tinibu is contesting as the president. Uh, Tinibu was my classmate in primary school. I am happy that um, he was the governor of Lagos State somebody should be there at, at least one person none of them it is not all of them that will you know die maybe because they are old or whatsoever okay somebody should be there but nobody has um you know made some claims of Tinibu was my classmate in primary school at least worry zone is different he has been meeting people or oh, worry meet um his a uh, primary school classmate and looking at them they are all men they remember oh this was uh, my classmate in so so primary school but this one nobody comes out i mean uh, but the judge will not just come out and you know allege some claim which he do not really really understand about so like i said um the court has dismissed the suit okay people loyal to tinibu um, had to, you know, file a suit for the court uh, not to hear uh, that certificate uh, forgery or certificate controversy issue. I mean, let us look at the truth. If somebody should tell me I do not have a YX certificate, I believe YX should have a database of their candidate. Yes. So why do you think I would need a lawyer to prove a certificate which I own. If I have a certificate, a university uh, certificate or degree, now somebody come alleging that I do not have a certificate, the university should be able to have a database 
I should be able to. Why will I order some lawyers to go and defend a certificate which I legitimately own? It doesn't work that way. I mean, so when you see issues like this, you begin to, you know, suspect some foul play. Okay, guys, um, more trouble for APC. Um, if it ever happens, <laughs> that means election will be between the uh, Peter Obi and Atiko Abubaka. And believe me, um, APC will not have uh, they will not have a choice than to support the um, Labour Party and Peter Obi because they will not in any way have anything to do with the PDP. But however, let me know what you guys think. See you in another update.